Warriors, welcome back. It's a lone wolf here. Welcome back to the sanctuary where you see I am on this massive platform. We're getting right back to work. Behind me, you'll see the coarse fruit growing, but I need that for part of this build. And uh, you'll see why here in just a little bit, hopefully this episode. So uh, let's just let's just get started, shall we? So, uh, if you haven't watched the previous episode, I took a huge hiatus from YouTube, almost four months to the day, and yeah, now I'm back. So, I just want to get going on this. So, uh, we got the outline that you saw from the previous video. If you haven't already seen that video, again, uh, just watch this one and then uh, go see that one later. So, quickly... We got our outline going on here, and so I did this. This is the Northern Pier, I believe. Yes, the Northern Pier. And so I went through and I put stone down, so we have a base to work on. But now we got to work on the side details. This is going up probably maybe five blocks or something high, and then we'll, it'll be uh, covered again on the top. And then it will have individual buildings up here. So we're working on the side design. Now I'm going to do it on this pier. Basically I'm going to finish this pier and then mimic it on these other three. So I'm not going really, I guess you could say super slow. But yeah. So I really like the andesite. So if you can see here real quick. We got the andesite as the base block, and then we I've put in the stone brick on top, and uh, the texture pack I'm using is Faithful um, 32, and so that is the one I'm currently using for this build. Uh, let's see here. I love having ender pearls now because I can just kind of throw one up here and jump up and wait for that to land. Perfect. Alright, so we got that part there, and we're actually going to extend this up one more block. I don't know why that I put that there. We're going to put down this all around the edges here, and then because what this is kind of going to do, I'll, I'll do real quick here. Uh, I want to do a two block like this, I think it will actually be, yeah, two block, then I'll go like this, and then this will basically be the roof here. So if we follow this down, and then we'll put this here, kind of give you an idea of how this is going to look. I think that's how I want it. Let's look here. Is it? Is it? Yeah, something like that. And then there's going to be stuff behind it. I don't know what block I'm going to put behind it, but we'll just uh, discuss this real quick. So it will be kind of like... Oh, yeah, 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 I, I remember now. So these are all three, right? Okay. So those are all three. What's going to happen, actually, now that I remember what's in my inventory? Let's pull out the spruce. Oh, my keyboard's gone wonky on me. There we go and then the spruce will come up underneath it and oh, this is supposed to be spruce again right here something kinda like that I think it's really hard to tell from the from behind of course but yeah yep that's right because then this is going to go like here, and this is going to go right here. Like that? Is that like it? No, 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 no. Okay, 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 okay. I'm making this up as I go, guys. I'm making this up as I go. Don't, don't judge me here. Don't judge me as we're making this stuff up. As I'm making it up on the spot. Oh, yes, 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 yes. So this is going to go like that. Not like that. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that, guy. Don't do that. Oh, my gosh, the dirt. So it's going to go like that. So this actually has to come out one more because I want a nice ledge here. So this would come out like this. And then we got some. Oh, we forgot. We forgot to grab these. We forgot to grab them. Okay, so we got that right there. 
and then this is gonna go like this this is gonna go like this and then something like that and then we're gonna have the end rod it goes like this kind of as a, a thingamabobber and then kind of fill in the back something something like that uh, it's hard to explain hard to explain hard to see let's let's just jump out here let's just jump out here it looks it looks better in my head I promise you it'll look better uh yeah so anyways I'm gonna just go ahead I'm gonna fill this part in and then figure this part out uh is is it gonna look something something in that regard but just imagine it going all the way down and then you got this end rod here that's just kind of lighting up this whole pier so I'm just gonna go ahead put down the rest of the stone figure out the rest of the design and then uh, I'll bring it back so bloop 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 so it has actually been several days since I don't know why I'm checking hey look who's on it has been several days since I have worked on this um, you saw me derping up at the very beginning but as you can see I have completed all the walls for this now let me go and show you the design that I came up with it's kind of a pain but I, I think it's beautiful I think that is an absolutely beautiful wall using so this bottom layer right here as you can see is andesite that's our base layer on the edge with two layers of stone brick be quiet you over there two layers of stone brick along with spruce wood and then the cobblestone fences with end rods so this place actually at night will glow um, will we'll basically just all be lit up so this pattern will go all the way around I don't know about this middle portion here right there in the middle I don't know about that yet but it just it'll, it'll just all completely glow um, be nice and visible so just like you know the uh, Atlantis again that's the in inspiration for this build so the hard part was along the back oh look at that I even missed one I'll have to go back and get that um, the hard part was along the back because I got a mirror merit and you know I have four four of these piers that I gotta do so that's gonna be the hard part and then in the very back because it's an even number because it lines up with the guardian farm there in the background I added in some sea lanterns I kinda like that I might add that into some of the edges here uh, make it look like it's got some thrusters or whatnot because Atlantis is actually a, a giant spaceship you know so possibly add that in uh, to give it some lift and whatnot so let's grab an ender pearl ender pearls have been throwing these like crazy because that's how I get out of the water back into my build now the next part that I have to do here is see this is straight I don't like that I'm, I want to bring it down at an angle and then do an interior section and I'll go to about right here uh, so I'm gonna kind of bring it out and kind of loop it around kind of make it a circle and then we're gonna slab off the top here uh, finish up this middle portion and then I'll have to throw down a bunch of torches as well because uh, after I put over the put the top layer on I'm not gonna be able to um, uh, th this will just be a huge mob spawner so I need to make sure I torch it up and everything now there was one part I'm kinda curious about is putting um, I love how this looks underneath and I was thinking about adding in all these sea lanterns except I hate this part right here where it's kinda blocked but I'm thinking of adding sea lanterns all the way around the edge and then that actually lights up inside inside this area here uh, actually let's shoot um, it's getting dark let's uh, go outside real quick we have a new sleep mod I'm gonna keep kicking people we have a sleep plug-in that we've added we've gotten rid of the command block but it's going nighttime and let's uh, just look at this thing as it goes night absolutely beautiful let's let's go out a little bit let's go out a little bit We're gonna oh, kick him, kick him, kick, kick. Ah, yeah, that's right, kick him. I need, I need the night. 
I need the night so I can show you this see that's all disappearing there look at that just light up in the nighttime absolutely beautiful so we're gonna get back to work we're gonna add that second layer of um, stone brick on top slab it off torch it off and I will see you right after I finish that Boop. all right so as I showed you last it's been another couple days but as I showed you last I was out over there and it was nighttime but this pier has been completed for the most part as you can tell we're up here now uh, the last portion I had shown you let's uh, run over here it didn't have uh, these top two layers on yet here but it has been completed let's just jump into the water we'll go out a little bit so that is what it looks like currently I'll show you the inside here in just a second <clears throat> But that is what the bottom layer of this whole thing will look like. And again, it will go all the way around. There's another pier, another pier over there, there. Four piers, and they'll all have this bottom base design. Now, let's uh, since we're in the water, let's just float down here. I really love how this looks underneath. Really, really digging underneath how this looks just I don't know it just it looks awesome uh, I again I added in those sea lanterns even to the inner edge here and then let's uh, kinda go up here into the middle portion we continued that pattern along the middle portion we have two here oh I need to add sea lanterns there but um, just continue that same design here in the middle kinda tapered it off uh, let's ender pearl up here and so this area it's all been uh, stoned and stoned off and it this is where the buildings will go now I'm kind of uh, debating on how each one will go each pier will be unique originally everything was gonna like flow down in the middle right here to a central stores but I don't I just don't think we'll have the render range uh, to keep these chunks loaded to uh, bring stuff over like I can't even I can't even see my guardians over there but each I'm thinking about building like a building right here let's uh just do like like there'll be a central building in this area kinda like right here uh, very crude and then it'll have like uh, on each pier it'll have a central building and then it'll have towers that go up right and those towers like if this was wheat potatoes and carrots I would stand here in the central building load up these chunks everything would come down here into this into the central room here as a gathering point you have some uh, item uh, transport lines and whatnot but there's plenty of room up here for nice towers and builds I uh, really look forward to it let's uh, take these down real quick just take those down alright now uh, I'll show you underneath as well so uh, we kind of got this opening here you'll be able to see I'm kind of thinking of maybe actually adding a uh, um, maybe some glass right here so you can see in but this place will all be lit up from uh, the um, end rods there looking looking good so underneath <clears throat> I haven't quite decided what I'm gonna do underneath I got all these torches laid out I don't want to have a bunch of torches here so I'm kind of thinking maybe underneath each pier uh, in this area making maybe some kind of like engine reactor room because this this, this build uh, Atlantis is just a giant spaceship as well and I think you know having some engines or whatnot going on here in the back um, to help help lift this up maybe taking this section down a little bit having sea lanterns underneath as you know engines I, I, I don't know yet but there's just all this empty space <coughs> <coughs> excuse me all this empty space that is needing to be used so we'll uh, figure something out you know have some pillars or or something I, yeah, yeah, I just don't know but I think it turned out really good 
I love the uh, the spruce with the granite. The granite is a decorative block. Um, we could always no, I don't have any, but you know maybe add some pillars that go down here. The the cobblestone. I I just I just don't know, but I think it turned out really really well, a lot better than I actually. This is probably the most detailed I've ever built, and it's not very detailed, but it's the most detailed I've ever done. Uh, to be honest, I did a season one of the Master Builders. I did a pretty detailed build, but yeah, uh, it, it was mainly a fence. But and anyways, so that's uh, that's basically all I got time for today. Let's uh, Ender Pearl. I've used up a lot of Ender Pearls. This is just Ender Pearl up here, and uh, we'll just end the episode by saying thank you for watching. This is episode two here on the Sanctuary. It has taken me like a week and a half to make it. But as always, like, comment, subscribe down below. I love reading the comments. And I am already working on episode 3. I worked on that prior to this. And I'm going to jump right into that so I can get the next episode of the Sanctuary out. But as always, I am Lone Wolf. Thank you, Warriors, for watching. And I will catch you later.